bombers. These aircraft were introduced into the game recently and have already gained popularity. But how should one play bombers? Let's figure it out. The first thing that catches the eye is the dimensions of these aircraft. If compared to a fighter, this giant looks like a bus next to a car. Such a comparison is no coincidence. The maneuverability of a bomber and a regular bus are almost equivalent. If a bomber is being chased, it's almost impossible to escape a pursuer by maneuvering. This is just useless. It also makes no sense to attack an enemy aircraft head-on. A bomber has neither rockets nor powerful forward-firing armament. Anyway, this aircraft should not do this, because it's a bomber. The trump card of a bomber is the incredible power of its engines and, of course, bombs. Thanks to the long boost, it can quickly climb high. Very high. Having climbed up high, a bomber will automatically protect itself from most enemy aircraft. At this altitude, the biggest threat is posed by rare fighter interceptors and heavy fighters. So, it's necessary to stay sharp. The main, and virtually only, armament available for dogfighting is the powerful rear guns. They provide good protection in the automatic mode, and if necessary, the manual rear gun control mode can be enabled. The main thing is to control the aircraft in such a way that the enemy will remain in the field of fire. If this is the case, then the tail end Charlie will not fail. It is important to remember, a single fighter interceptor will not cause much trouble to a bomber. A heavy fighter presents a much bigger threat. Besides this, if several enemies at once turn out at the same altitude as a bomber, on no account should it engage. A bomber should activate boost and proceed to a place where its allies can cover it. No matter how an aerial battle unfolds, a bomber should not search for targets in the skies. Its main targets are on the ground. A bomber carries tons of bombs on board. It can, and should, destroy ground targets with these bombs. The best way to do this is to deploy bombs in the bombsite mode. When approaching a sector, the bombsite mode should be enabled and the parcels should be dropped directly on target. Targets to be destroyed first are air defense facilities. The biggest threat for bombers is posed by large caliber AA guns. By successfully bombing targets, bomber pilots can capture key areas. This is how they will benefit their team the most and really enjoy playing this aircraft type. Get airborne again!